theatre and film are always about communication of ideas, the use of the imagination, some kind of cultural conversation, a culture having a conversation with itself. Knuckle down to some serious study. Pray hard. Not for me, but for you. You can become like me. We are fascinated by our athletes, in a way, because that's quite tangible, but Jeffrey's a remarkable athlete of the mind and of the spirit, <laughs> and highly decorated one. No, no, we haven't the time. Talk pros. Where is my play? I think people tend to get quite awards obsessed when they think about acting, but it's hard not to get awards obsessed when you think about Jeffrey, given that he's won the Emmy, the Academy Award, and the Tony Award, the only Australian to do that. You've got one instrument, which is your body, with its imagination, with its accumulated technique. You have to work and refine and hone that to a point where you get to know yourself. And I think you've got to be pretty brutal in self-analysis to say, I was really crap in that, what can I learn from? There's that unique and authentic Australian quality to him. But he also plays the world. He's an Australian that plays the world. Hello. I'm Peter. Peter Sellers. I suppose the only time I reflect back on my career uh, is when younger performers seek advice. I think I have maybe three rule book things. Always follow gut instinct, always be on high alert, and be prepared to take risks. Jeffrey's a, a, a genuine man of the theatre. He's not precious. He will try anything. He has an incredibly unique performance style which is absolutely born out of this country. It's, it's visceral, it's electric, it's funny and it's poignant. Come into my body, under my skin. Into my eyes, rekindle their failing light so I can see, I can see, I can see. The extraordinary trail that he has blazed around the globe stands as a, as a, as a beacon for, for our whole industry in Australia about the kind of progress and the kind of intensity of, and commitment to performance that, uh, that one person can have. I see the hope of the world in you. And from my heart, I thank you. He's not just um, supporting the arts here, he's supporting our reputation. The whole culture of the city and the country is one of his major interests and he's one of the major battlers for it. So he's out there all the time making sure that we get known and appreciated around the world. I mean, the fundamental thing of theatre and film expression is that it's a chance for people to gather publicly in some kind of random forum um, to deal with ideas and imagination. And to me, that's one of the most exhilarating uh, experiences that you can have. Gents, our hope is restored! That is what is wonderful about this unique artist who belongs to the world, but is one of ours. Forget everything else. And just say it to me. It's been meaningful for me, I suppose, in a very personal way to have played unusual Australian characters like Lionel Lowe or David Helfcott in films that have made a mark in the international arena that gives yet another subtler, more curious, unpredictable version of what the Australian character can be.